Like when he goes sometimes. far as you. Uh, yeah. What are you talking about, sir? Oh, uh, mm -hmm. I think we know. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, you know. I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, you do. No, I, what is it? I can see it in your eyes. Okay. Excuse me. And the grin. I don't have a grin. <laughs> <laughs> And she's recording. <laughs> okay. You're talking about I'm recording because you're recording me all morning. Any other questions? He's gonna start recording. <laughs> hey, where'd he go? <laughs> so it's officially the end of the week. I actually had a really um crazy week because I was sick and I wasn't feeling good and all that. So I really um I was trying to recover, recuperate and recover and yeah, but I just, you know, it was a good week overall. Um, lots of work stuff going on, a lot of new things happening. I used to need some chapstick because um, I have really chapped lips right now and like there's this piece of skin right here and it's really gross and it just looks really good. Um, yeah, that's the end of the week. Um, it's been good. I don't like this little skin. So I'm trying not to like bite it or whatever. I'm trying to just let it fall off. So I just got out of the and they put power tools on my teeth. So my teeth kind of hurt slightly um, because they're applying a lot more pressure now that those are on to kind of get rid of some of the space. All that pressure was like, dang. Um, I definitely felt all the pressure. I was kind of like, damn, okay, I get it. I'm in the same club, and I shouldn't be because I always spend too much money. Well, I'm not even in here right now. Lord may never know. But especially the snack section, I could spend all my money in here. What is this? Zero twist. Oh my god. But anyway, so yeah, I'm just shopping. And it's funny because look how much I already have, and I don't need it. Yeah. 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 Just take all my money. All the money. I'm just give me one second. Okay. Okay, yes, sir. Um, can I get a medium caramel macchiato? Yes, with extra water. Um, I want it iced. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Guys, I just got back to the house, and this is all of the stuff that I bought from Sam's. Um, I really didn't go all out <laughs> like I wanted to. But I'm really excited to try this. Um, it's like the Mediterranean salad. So I was like, I'm going to shred some of my rotisserie chicken. Put it in that. Yeah, whatever. I'm weird. I be mixing shit up. But anyway, I just got my dog some treats. So I'm going to see how she likes them. They're peanut butter flavored. And she really eat anything. But we're going to see if she likes these. Mm. Say Go ahead and pull up her tree jar because as you can tell, she's pretty low. Um, so what I'm gonna do is actually take these out and then put those on top because that just makes sense, right? So they say like wolf. I don't know if y'all can see that. It says wolf, that's so cute. Anyway. Her 
and like I said, I just put the new ones at the bottom and then I put the older ones at the top. So then I have an entire bag left in here. So it's actually pretty good. So I've actually tried to start decorating um, like my pantry and organizing it so that it just is, you know, aesthetically pleasing. It's unnecessary, y'all, and I know that. But um, we don't have a house yet, so y'all, when I see my house, y'all gonna be like, damn because i'm gonna go all the way out um but for the meantime while we're in our apartment we just gonna do what we can do and so right now i bought this big pack which is not all gonna fit, fit in here sam's be having what you need Right now, if you can tell, this whole room is kind of a hot ass mess because we are moving and I'm super excited about it because I get to kind of go through everything and refresh everything and reorganize things the way that I would like them to be organized in the first place. And currently I'm doing my gift wrap so I have actually cleared out this entire bin and I'm going to transfer my new wrapping paper, which let me show you guys, it's super cute and I have it kind of themed this year. Um, because I'm not going to be able to like de um, decor, decorate for Christmas until we get moved in. But these are the gift wraps that I selected this year. I'm going to work on all this makeup in this plastic container here. And I'm gonna go ahead and start putting it into this plastic container for transport. Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna work on putting all of this into this container for easier transport. And also makeup in here too, because this um, desk is gonna be extra heavy if I don't, um, you know, take out all the things in the drawers. So yeah, and my makeup's my pride and joy, so I have to make sure it gets transported the way it should get transported, protected. I thought that I would just come on and do a quick update on how far I got with my makeup. So pretty much, I'm proud of myself, so there are some people who be like, that's a lot of makeup. To me, it's not. Um, I definitely had a lot more makeup, but I have condensed. So I can stand up here and tell you some stories about how me and my brother have known each other for, you know, a very long time. How she saved me. A burning building, but that would just be all. So <laughs> instead, I'm going to bring this back for bring the Navy into this because you know me. Um, so our core values in the Navy are on their courage. Honor basically is holding something in high regards or esteem and uh, experience to one time. And I believe you embody that. So you are basically this, you are just everything you do. You are Air Force, Moto all the way. And I love it. Courage, you have the courage to stand up for what you believe is right. You always are doing what you think is important, you put patients first, you put your other airmen first, um, and you want to make sure that they're, everything in public health is right. Commitment, you're committed to the Air Force mission. Um, I know that you would drop everything that you're doing to you know, have to go and take care of any sort of mission uh, or deployment or anything like that uh, for this country. So. To me, you embody the Navy core values. Um, so, the last thing I want to say is that your laugh is super infectious, <laughs> and that That's I love. <laughs> <laughs> I like to say I don't know. Is this it's 
I like to say she laughs like a semi drunk. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. I'm very proud of you. Keep striving. Um, you're going to go far no matter where you are in your Air Force career or outside the Air Force. So I'm very proud of you for being here. Thank you. And also. <laughs> <laughs> So this is like a weird angle. I don't know why I always do that. Like, is it gonna make me prettier? I don't know. But I just wanted to bring up the fact that I just had my promotion ceremony. Um, but I just had my promotion ceremony, and I am really grateful for not only my team, but just God, right? Just the way that God operates in my life and the way the universe allows things to align itself. Um, I don't want to say like in my favor, but in my favor. I'm just really happy and, you know, I'm grateful for the people that continue to show up for me. I had my ceremony just now, even though I pinned on a couple weeks ago, not a couple weeks ago, well, about three weeks ago. You know, things don't always go according to plan as far as whatever. But I actually realized that most of the time, not all the time, 99.5% of the time, in my opinion, things just work out in my favor. And when I say that, I mean, just they do, you know, they just really work out. And I'm just... I'm like, oh my gosh, like, you know, I thought this, but really this had happened better. So shout out to the people who are showing up for me. And then I understand life happens, but you know, y'all the real ones. So anyways, um, yeah, just super happy, super blessed. And that's it. So I'm gonna talk to you guys later. If you guys enjoyed this vlog, if you guys enjoyed this vlog, go ahead and thumbs up the video. Do not forget to subscribe. And as always, thank you for coming back to watch another video. All right. Talk to you guys later. No capper, street nigga, not a rapper. Chopper hit him and he turned into a booty clapper. Smith and Wesson, a 4L gang reppin'.